Hey guys, and this is the Hunter 715 update, and um, we'll go ahead and start off with Survival. Now, Survival saw a few tweaks here, and a bunch of abilities were swapped around either for their damage values uh, or also their cooldowns. Uh, Lacerate, for example, just straight up lost its cooldown. It's now just an ability you can spam. Um, so that had to be adjusted. It led to a bug right off the bat. Uh, but uh, it'll work the same way as it did before, where it'll tell you to kind of store up your mongoose bites in preparation for Aspect of the Eagle, and uh, once you use it, it'll have you pump them all out. So this is all based around the rotation for Aspect of the Eagle and using your Mongoose Bites with at least two stacks otherwise and uh, all your other abilities will show up as they did before. Um, not a lot has actually changed in the rotation, it's just a few damage tweaks overall but the priority of a lot of spells has actually remained the same and um, as always they remain very bursty single target DPS. Uh, and uh, that's probably where they're going to stay for a little bit. This Blizzard seems to be pretty happy with that state. Um, so nothing really to concern yourself with this spec. Uh, moving on into Beast Mastery, and there's been a few tweaks to the rotation for Beast Mastery overall. Um, b big one for Beast Mastery is just that they, they lowered the cooldown of certain spells like Dire, uh, dire Beast is now... Uh, 12 seconds and everything else kind of revolves around that uh, but as always it will focus around your abilities and uh, I had to adjust things like Cobra Shot so that it uses it only plus 90 focus whereas before it was um, I believe plus 45 uh, so that has been tweaked and adjusted and this is mostly to just compensate for a lot of the changes that had to take place in the, in the spec but you should find yourself doing the same amount of damage and uh, the Beast Cleave timer is now part of the rotation so uh, or part of the profile if you didn't have the uh, cleave time here in there before um, but yeah you should have again no problem just going right into this um, one big thing for this spec and also for marksman because of the changes of barrage it's no longer used in the single target rotation it's purely cleave it does barely any damage single target so it has been removed from the rotation entirely so using it will completely depend on its cooldown and your judgment you'll see the cooldown if you take the talent just like here in marksman now for marksman um a lot of things happened, a lot of tweaks, a lot of spell changes. But one thing that's new is uh, there's a bunch of talents, but uh, Explosive Shot now acts a little differently. And I went ahead and put a range tracker for Explosive Shot, that as soon as you press it, it'll tell you the travel range of the Explosive Shot. And this is done just on, based on a little bit of math that I did. Um, it's not exactly 100% accurate, but it's pretty precise. So you should have no problem uh, getting the most out of it. It should uh, be able to tell you a rough idea of how close you are to the target. So every time you use Explosive Shot, that bar will appear on the bottom, it'll give you the range. Um, as for the rotation itself, it has been adjusted and um, they've changed how Vulnerable works and how Patient Sniper works and all the talents that interact with it. So all those had to be tweaked and the whole rotation had to be redone just to make up for all the things that were changed. Um, right now I'm testing out Sidewinders, which is not the ideal spec, but it was something I wanted to test out. Um, but yeah, you should have no problem hopping into this and getting the most out of it right away. Uh, but yeah, as always, you can find this on chester.weebly.com. You'll also be able to see it on the Reddit, and also I will update the rebrandly links. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys like what you see, and I will catch you in the next video.